Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Molly. If you're new, I am so excited to be filming this what I eat in the day. It is a super gloomy, dark, miserable day today and I just feel like yummy foods if I'm honest. That's exactly what I want. I know I'm going to be having pasta at some point and I don't know what else I want throughout the day but I'm very excited to bring you guys along with me. I hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get right into it. I really feel like I need to just get better at cooking and I honestly feel like filming this sort of video will motivate me to do that. However, there is a farmer's market on this morning so I thought we could go and check it out together. I'm really, I literally feel like a matcha or an ice latte. Like I just feel like a drink that is gonna be worth the seven or ten dollars I just woke up craving one. I obviously had some water this morning. I hate drinking water in the morning. I don't know about anyone else. I thought we could go to the farmer's market together because I'm always hungover on a Sunday and I never go. So I thought it'd be really fun if we went together and I could like show you some cute... There's a packet of chips on my floor. Um, I thought it would be fun if we went together and I could show you some of like the local produce and also what everyone has to offer at the market. I'm excited. Oh, Alfie, you're so handsome. You just wait like that all day. I'm so proud of myself for braving this dark and gloomy weather. Go off, look at me go heading to the market on a Sunday. Who would have thought, not me. Look how many people were up and about and just ready for a good wholesome market experience. So many people brought their kids, which was really cute to see. So many people had like really cute shopping trolleys and it was just so nice to see all the fresh produce. Even though I was in the rain, I still enjoyed it thoroughly and I would highly recommend going to your local farmer's market. It is so fun and who doesn't want like a little treat yourself moment? Here's some pics that I took because I was too scared to whip out my camera. Oh my god, okay. It is absolutely freezing. It's time for a taste test. I would never make a crepe or even know how to begin to make a good one. Um, so I'm very excited. I got mine. It's got spinach, goat's cheese, mushroom, um, and I think egg and like a paste. So they use like all fresh products that were there at the market, which is really cute. They like all support each other. I haven't had a crepe in millions of years like with school we would get crepes like crepe day like but that's about it like so I haven't had one in so long I don't really know what to expect I was gonna get a drink but it is absolutely freezing I might just make my own matcha or latte at home who is calling me oh. hi okay taste test time I don't know how to like unravel this without it going everywhere look how good it looks though yum i think it was like 15 or 16 bucks supporting local we love it um i don't know how to like eat this without eating the paper the mushrooms are so good god what a good start to this video okay i have to head home because i have to get my parents the paper and i really feel like a drink now so oh also they had um they had, here's a photo, almond milk. I was going to try it, but it started raining and then my umbrella tipped upside down and I don't have enough hands and it was just like a lot. So that looked really yummy. Like they had a lot of good fresh produce there. They had scones, bow -ro, bow -ro bun things. I don't know how to say it. They had a bunch of other food stores, which was really good. And I would highly recommend going to your local market and getting yourself a yummy breakfast or a yummy brunch moment they had so many options a lot of fresh fruit and veg which is really good and i highly recommend checking your local market out it looks like so messy and like not appealing now because i just i don't know how to eat it but it's so yummy yeah i'm just like editing this video and answering emails nothing like too exciting to be honest then i thought let's take it that one step further and do some physical exercise Look at me go, braving the weather. Today, I really was doing the most. <laughs> you just look so stupid. <laughs> um, since I'm doing a what I eat 
today, Mum, do you have any like tips and tricks? She's a bit of a health queen, Kate. Brussels sprouts. Brussels sprouts. Um, you're doing. Mum's a bit hungover today, so she's probably not going to be the best help on giving tips. But when you're hungover, what do you like to eat? Clean food, Japanese. Yeah, we've got dumplings in the freezer. I think I'm going to have some Japanese today. Maybe we should go get some miso soup. Yes. Yeah. We've got some miso though. I know. Mum's a bit of a health queen. She likes us to eat really healthily on Mondays to Fridays. Well, Thursdays pretty much because Fridays are free for all. Sorry, that was a really shitty example of some like what I eat in the day tips and tricks from Kate. She was not serving at all. But like look how cute and pretty the weather is in winter and autumn. I love it when it's so wholesome like that and the leaves are falling down really pretty okay i'm one of those people but like look how cute alfie is i'm sorry i couldn't not add this in he was being a bit annoying and a bit excited so he wasn't really giving me like the posy moments but look at him here oh wow he's really going for it he's like pay attention to me quick wholesome i love him yum taste test it tastes pretty good. Okay, this matcha is so good. I need to stir it at the bottom and some of it's like sitting there. So yummy. I definitely feel like I could master it and create one myself. I know a lot of people like in America and the UK have like a lot of other like creamer and syrups and stuff. So I'd like to try that as well. I think it'd be fun. Literally starving after that walk. That was very much needed. I feel like a lot of the time I'm not really hungry in the morning. Um, and I feel like exercise is a really good thing to do in the morning because then you kind of like get your metabolism moving and then you're like actually hungry. So I'm literally starving. It's currently now one o'clock. This is usually when I would have lunch anyway. So, oh, it's very windy outside. We are gonna make a Japanese lunch. We've got some Edamame, yum, so yummy and salty, pork chive dumplings for the family, they do look pretty good, I must say myself. This is my favourite brand of dumplings but I only have three left in the veggie gyoza, super cute, but um, yeah I'm going to have to just try some chicken dumplings today because I'm not going to go down to the shops and get some others. So I'm going to give these a whirl. I've got some miso soup because mum and I want one. It's like a little entree. And some cocktail spring rolls. What's not to love? I am going to be the master chef in the kitchen for lunch um, for everyone. So here's a fun little montage. I'm just heating up a lot of food to be honest. I'm gonna, I think, air fry the edamame as well as the spring rolls. The thing that stresses me out about cooking, it's, it's all about the timing, which I'm not good at, time management, so. start to stick like what do I do then like I, I want them pan fried but then also like you just put the water on at the end you know what I mean like I hate when they start sticking
Ew, I just licked that miso soup. Ugh, the paste. That wasn't as good as I thought. Fortunately, the miso soup in like the packet just doesn't hit the same as the one that you would get from a restaurant and the colour is a bit funky, but I mean, it tastes nice, it's salty. I just like the ones that you buy from a restaurant better, but oh well. It is currently three o'clock, so I mean, I could have a snack in like an hour or so. so. I'm really craving some popcorn. I'm really craving some popcorn. I've also made a list of things that I need to get for dinner tonight and work throughout the week, so I'm very excited. I parked really far away from the shop, so which is stupid. But yeah, I'm so excited for this popcorn. It's honestly my newest addiction. I love microwave popcorn. I think it's so nice and buttery and salty and chef's kiss. Whole time I got this is the best pasta we're having this for dinner tonight it is a it's like a thicker penne pasta love for some reason the boxes of popcorn completely ran out so I had to get like five packets of the microwave popcorn but it is five o'clock I am kind of pushing it we do have dinner around like 7 38 so could have a light snack I don't know um Muesli bars. I got this, which I'm really excited to try. It's a mocha but caramel flavor, so I hope that tastes delish. And it's Cadbury, love. I got this barista oat milk, which should be good. My coffee's in the morning. This is the best garlic bread ever. Don't fight me on it. Other items I got was like pesto, mushrooms, um, milk for everyone else. Um, oh, I got my packet rice, which is delish. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much my haul over and complete with. Let's go make some more food because I am so hungry today. It's now nine o'clock. I'm sorry if you can hear opera singing in the background. We were watching the Queen Jubilee, which was popping off. I had mad FOMO. Um, I can't not have my my microwave popcorn. It's just so good. Mia wants some, so we'll just half it. I usually get this one that's just like the original. They had like light, sweet, savory, like all different other triple cheese, whatever. I mean butter, not 
oh jeez but yeah um i can't not have it check out this new microwave we got she's got a handle and everything love that is it for today's video thank you so much for hanging out with me i'm gonna demolish this popcorn i had so much fun hanging out with you guys today i hope you enjoyed this video if there is one thing you take away from this video it's the popcorn it's the popcorn guys get onto it it's honestly you won't regret it thank you so much for watching if you stayed this long and i'll see you soon bye